Halo guys, aku baru aja pulang kerja, makanya muka aku agak dekil kusam dan menjijikkan. Anyways, cara nyalain terjemahan di, di video aku itu tinggal nyalakan tombol sisi, habis itu samping tombol sisi ada yang tiga titik itu kalian tinggal pencet, terus di bagian subtitle atau caption kalian bisa pilih bahasa Inggris atau bahasa Indonesia Oke? Okay. Oke, okay, first thing first, I'm gonna start cleaning my makeup Since I got here um, in Australia, I have been always like use oil-based cleansing product to remove my makeup because it's just it it, it doesn't dry my skin and like I have a combination skin so like there's this area where there's so dry and also oily at the same time yeah my skin is complicated like my life but anyways as you can see okay i look like i drag it so harsh but i actually didn't like yeah i just want them to be clean okay look at the difference this one is without makeup this one is with makeup i don't know the difference either but Ah, it's time for my lip. I always like flip them around because okay, I haven't show you guys. It's this one. It's the facial cleansing oil by Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula, whatever. I don't know. I bought this actually by like because I was looking for the cleansing balm, but they're actually quite expensive. So I was like, oh no, let me try this, and it actually works wonder for me. So yeah, this is product and lips time i barely use much on my lips it looks much because of the lip gloss there we go okay now i'm gonna wash off these oils on my face and i'm using this cleanser from q a q plus a i don't know and they are a hyaluronic acid cleanser which is really good for hydrating your skin it does not dry your skin at all it's really good i love this as you can see i didn't i didn't like um wet my face first before i put this on I heard that it makes it better and it's can clean your skin so much more than wetting them so I'm gonna wet them after this is after I wet them make them firmy and then I'm gonna wash them off I'm finally done washing my face as you can see it's very clean until you can see my dark circle Let's not talk about that. I am going to... Why is my camera going down, bro? Are you okay? I exfoliate my face like um, two times a week whenever I feel like it. I'm using this to exfoliate them. Mm, it's the Ordinary Salicylic Acid Mask. Salicylic Acid. Why is it so complicated to say the name? Damn, anyways. I'm gonna use this. <laughs> oh. I'll be back. By the way, about this face mask, I don't recommend you to use it after you scrub your face or after you exfoliate your face because when you put it on your skin, it's gonna sting a little bit. It doesn't hurt that much, but I'm pretty sure if you put it on an open wound or after you pop your pimple, it's gonna hurt. So yeah anyways i'm gonna wait for like 10 minutes and i'm gonna wash them off with a warm clothes by the way while i'm wiping my face um in high school, I used to have so many pimples on my face 
like I'm literally so embarrassed of them that every time when I'm talking to people, I will like look down or I will cover like my face with my hair because I was so embarrassed with my pimple and none of my friends is freaking like have pimple on their face like barely so yeah I have that experience so I literally before this I tried everything to make my skin clean but I guess it's just a hormone like every mask like tomato mask Aquamask, mask I try all of them and because of that I never allow anyone to touch my face with their bare hands you can ask any of my close friends if they touch my face I will be very very mad because my face is so sensitive that if you touch it I'm gonna get a pimple the next day it is that sensitive but now I don't think my face is that sensitive it's just that before when I have a lot of acne on my face it's, it, it's very sensitive so yeah oh and by the way don't if you wanna avoid acne don't touch your face with your dirty hand remember to wash your face this is why after shower I never touch anything first like I'm not even wearing my clothes after I shower and I literally do my skincare first because I don't want to touch anything before my face Okay, now that I'm done, this is the first product that I use. It's the Hada Labo. Um, I can't read Japanese. I swear everything in here is in Japanese, like legit. But the only English is this one. It's Whining Lotion Rich. But basically, I saw this product on TikTok and I've been using it for a while now. It's really good. Um, it says whitening, but I don't think it's whitening my skin. It's just basically hydrate my skin. And they have the ingredients, the hyaluronic acid that I really love. The one that came with my cleanser as well. So yeah, it's basically like a toner. It's, look, it's very um, liquid, liquidy. <laughs> second product is this one anyways i put them upside down because it's easier for me to pour out because it's about to be gone but anyways this is also from hada labo um it's the premium hydrating lotion it does what it says it says hydrating it legit will hydrate your skin it's like a serum and it's very thick look at that third product is this one it's from q plus a as well it's a vitamin c brightening serum i I don't know this is my first time using it and so far it's so good it doesn't sting my skin at all i mean like i used to use the ordinary vitamin c they have two different kind of vitamin c for the ordinary but they kind of sting my skin because the um the vitamin c in the serum is very high which is why it sting my skin but for this one it's pretty safe for you guys out there who is like a first timer for vitamin c basically if you use vitamin c it's good for your acne scar it will reduce the scar and it will like fade faster girl what are you saying anyways i hope you guys get that fourth product is this one and the product inside them is actually this one it's the rose hydrating mist toner by sukin it's pretty good for hydration I love to add this at the end of my skincare to add extra hydration to my skin especially after I exfoliate my skin or scrub my skin so yeah and if you ask why I turn off the light when I'm using this I just 
I feel like it looks cool because <laughs> they have lights. Look, look at that, right? <laughs> okay, the whole thing about my skincare when I pick a skincare for my face, I never pick a skincare with a perfume in it. So, all of my skincare that you saw just now, even the cleanser, everything is perfume free. So, in Australia, they barely put perfume in the skincare because it's bad for your skin which is and my skin is sensitive to that i realize now in indonesia all of our um skincare product they have perfume in it which is why they smell good this skincare doesn't smell good at all but they works wonder on my face uh, in here even like for me i picked like a new serum or whatever as long as it's perfume free my face will be fine like i will not break out i will not have any acne at all so yeah perfume is not for my face now that i'm done with my face product let's move to my body care Okay, a few weeks ago, I got sent a product by Scarlett. <laughs> I've been using them for a couple weeks and so far, so good. Let me tell you about them. First thing first, they sent me three shower scrub and you can tell which one is my favorite. Yep, definitely this one because I use this one more often than the other two, as you can see. And they have this little particle to help you to scrub your skin and pick up your dead skin cell, which is really good for the end of the day. And they smell so good. And the color, look at the color. I mean, what could go wrong with purple, right? The body scrub. I only use this twice a week. I don't use them every day. They contain glutathione and vitamin E. Basically, all of their products contain this, which is really good for your skin. So they also have these little bits inside the scrub that will help you to pick up your dead skin cell. And it's not harsh at all. It's really soft for the skin. And my favorite? the lotion okay this lotion right here they absorb really quickly to your skin they're not sticky at all like my skin feels so soft after you use this and sadly they only sent me one of the lotion i really want more i might get more so for the lotion it says brightening right i try it as a joke for like three days on one of my legs so the other leg i didn't put the lotion at all and i'll show you a picture here Look at that. And I thought my skin was bright. Best thing out of everything is that not only they smell good, they are also affordable. They're very cheap. They only cost you like 7.5 Australian dollar. This one, same price, same price. Everything with a shower scrub as well. It's so cheap. So definitely check them out on Instagram. It's um, scarlet underscore whitening. I hope you guys like it as much as I do because I really love them. I love the lotion. Please send me more. <laughs> so yeah, that's it for my nighttime skincare routine and my body care. Oh, and by the way, my cheek is red because Australia is really cold right now. But anyways, for skincare, um, I don't. As you can see, I don't have much going on. The thing that I put to my face on my face because I believe in quality more than quantity. Because like before, when I first started skincare, I watched all the video like YouTuber, they be having like toner, serum, essence, night cream, and then whatever, a lot. So for you guys who is like a beginner on skincare and you guys want like a healthy skin, please, please, please do your research. You do not have to have everything. You see, I only have a toner and a serum. I don't even have a night cream. 
you do not have to have everything to get a healthy skin just put what your skin need instead of what you think you should put on your skin please do your research so yeah thank you for watching my video and supporting my video i hope you guys like it and please don't skip the ads good night <laughs>